I imagine you're running late to work. Oh, no, so we wouldn't want to bother that you. That would be wonderful, officer. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love that she's the spicy one. Which one is going to matter 100 years from now? Mm. Which one is going to make you the first? Mm. What's up everyone? Welcome to the channel. Today we're watching Hidden Figures. I love Taraji. I hear Janae Monae is in this as well. I'm excited for a good time. It has maths, science, black women, women empowerment, and I'm sure giving these women the props that they deserve and giving them their flowers and how they contributed in some way in um, science, space travel. Good bit of history. Thank you for watching. Please hit that like button. It's the best way you can support. Consider subscribing do all that good youtube stuff to help the video perform well thank you so much i appreciate it thank you to my channel members patreon all of you for voting supporting appreciate you let us watch hidden figures based on true events 14 15 20 west virginia baby it's the only school the eighth grade anywhere near here wow scalene collateral Rhombus. Hmm. <laughs> Big brain. Catherine's in the sixth grade. Tetrahedron. Dodecahedron. Is this when she was little? All you have to do is get there. Why don't you solve the equation on the board? Oh, she was a genius genius. We took up a collection amongst the teachers and said. <laughs> they are all bamboozled. <laughs> and common sense says at least one of the two has to be zero to start with. Common sense. But the quadratics into a form that can be factored. Once you've done that, it's pretty straightforward from there. <laughs> Bars. <laughs> you have to see what she becomes. Gotta see through. Hidden figures. Mm, that name means a lot, that title. <laughs> Taraji, I freaking love her, man. <laughs> Janae. Okay, trying to turn it over now. Mary, somebody. <laughs> somebody, please. Not death. I wonder sometime. That is definitely the start. It's stuck in the middle of nowhere. We all gonna end up unemployed riding around in this pile of... <laughs> oh, sit in the back of the bus. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'll hitchhike. Girls. Oh, shit. Here we go. No crime in a broken down car. Behind your mouth. I'll do my best, shoot. Why is your freaking siren on? For what? You just know he about to be on some bullshit. You have identification on me? Yes, sir. At Langley? We do a great deal of the calculating. Mm-hmm. All three of you? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes, officer. Yes, sir. She's not taking his shit. There are quite a few women working in the space program. Mm-hmm. Damn Russians are watching us right now. Yes, sir. <laughs> we work with those gentlemen. <laughs> yes, for certain. Right. Uh, what, y'all need a tow or something? Oh, give them a ride. Just need to bypass the starter. Well, I imagine you're running late to work. Oh, no, sir. <laughs> Hurry up, George, before he changes his mind. <laughs> I love that she's the spicy one. And of course, I mean, I already know this movie about to be filled with some racism and misogyny and obviously th them ladies gonna stand tall but i love the fact that janae's character she got a loud mouth <laughs> so i know she finna smoke them in this movie let's go oh, Mary, Mary, slow down, you be quiet. He said follow oh she's speeding <laughs> oh i'll tell you where to begin three negro women are chasing she them. feel good Mama, I'm riding the bus. <laughs> 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 Private escort. That was awesome. I like that they showed her backstory. Angle 46.56. Damn, they used to look like that. So they're monitoring the Russians. A brave space traveler. Have proven life can be sustained in space. And then a 1.6 megaton RDS. Just that, 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 that. Who the that. hell is he? <laughs> you know what's dangerous, Mr. Stafford? Planet taking pictures of God knows what. Mm. 
that doesn't put anything in space. Is this where our ladies come in? You think you enlighten the administrator? Look enlighten you, Sam? Mm-mm. I need a mathematician. I'll put in another request, sir. Mm-hmm. Well, tell me something else, Ruth, like we're gonna f on the damn moon. Oh, you, you get a few. I like where this is going already. All the nice setups. Eleanor, data reduction building 202. Oh, wow, that was a gang of them. Plasma dynamics. Oh, no, ma'am. Data reduction is just fine. Mm-hmm. Oh, they had a whole squad. I love it. Mr. Zelensky's requesting you for a permanent assignment. Are you serious? <laughs> she woo. Ooh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Everything's temporary, Dorothy. Ma'am, Catherine's the gal for that. Mm -hmm. May I ask why? Fast with rocket ships, slow with advancement. We need it for the redstone test. Damn, and I bet she ain't getting paid like a supervisor. <laughs> She's so amazed. Tunnel test, T minus one minute. <laughs> Tunnel test. Uh, are y'all gonna wait for her to get out? Where's your life? One, one moment. Why did y'all start when she was still inside anyways? Five, four. The hell? Shut it down. Already failed. Fasten other than the boat? Yes. Yes. Correct. For life. Mr. Zelensky. Now I'm standing that's going to carry an astronaut. Mm. We are living the impossible. I love that. If you were a white male, I wouldn't have to. I'd already be. <laughs> Skirts must be worn past the knee. I love that because it's one, let's say, minority or oppressed group, like recognizing the plight of another. You know what I'm saying? And like having that connection, which I really love. I love that a lot. Come on, keep up. Your clearance. Don't embarrass me. Jesus Christ. The fuck? Don't embarrass you. Stand tall, baby girl. Stand tall. Boy, y'all seen a ghost? Stand tall, baby. Keep it moving, y'all. What y'all looking at? Does she handle analytic? Absolutely. And she speaks. You can ask her. She's right there. Which one? Geometry and speaking. <laughs> Ruth, uh, get me the... You think you can find me the Frenet frame for this data? I prefer it over Euclidean coordinates. <laughs> Tell him, girl. And I'm also going to ask you to check Mr. Stafford's... And handle that I'm out. I'm sure you can, Paul. I'm sure they... <laughs> Shingles wouldn't be for show now, would they? Oof. And I have no doubt in my mind that they're going to be space and it's never been done before. Mm. So this space task group will be as advertised. I'm not going to have a problem. Good. So let's have an amen, damn it. Some egos are going to be bruised in this room. Golly. Because now, yo, <laughs> now she has to check your works as well. Mm. Let's see. <laughs> Keep your head up, baby girl. The rest is classified. You don't have clearance. Okay, douchebag. May I ask what the ladies' room is? I have no idea what your bathroom is. What you mean, your bathroom? God, this movie's gonna piss me off. <laughs> Taraji is so good at what she does. Every single thing I've seen her in, A+. Plus. Don't act like you was there. She is running in them heels, boy. Run it. Bro! Ruth, where's that girl with the numbers? We'll take breaks now? Well, you gave her a job to do, but someone also gave her another job, so don't freaking blame her. The end of the day around here was yesterday. I need those done first. He wants those done first. She can hear. Damn. Or are you going to tell her she can't drink coffee, or...? your head up baby it's hard to be sure sir you know what we're doing here i said you can throw it away obsolete that's how fast things are moving around mm. in my mind i'm already there yes sir 
good. Give her all the tools. Can I go, sir? Yes, you can go. If you want the best out of her, give her all the resources she needs. At least the decency to do her work in peace. Aren't you the head man in charge? I haven't been late one day. Haven't been out sick. Haven't complained. Mm -hmm. Time is done right. It's done well. Not the title of the page. Exactly. I'll be back with the computers in the week. Mm -mm. Pencil move as fast as your mind does. You'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Have some respect. This is your living room. <laughs> <laughs> Keep your feet off my shit. You do. <laughs> you don't mess with Mrs. Mom. <laughs> I love that. Confiding in each other and like talking through it. I mean, you always love to see, man. That's how we get on. Hey, baby. I was fixing to call the National Guard. <laughs> they're pretending to be. But they're not pretending well enough. Are oh, those her kids? We'll also do the dishes, all of Joyland's <laughs> chores. That seems fair. The Ben sleep a long time ago. You've been gone for 300 hours. Mm. I know I work a full time job. I have to be mommy and daddy. Mm, that's their mom. I miss your father just as much as anyone. Mm, did he pass? Yes, he's with all the angels every minute. Okay. Mm. Mama, are the Russians fixing to attack us? <laughs> we had to hide under our desk today. You practice safety just just in case. <laughs> I'm loving this so much because I'm loving that she has this beautiful support system at home. From the sound of it, she had a loving husband and she got these beautiful girls to freaking, you know, warm her heart. And she got her mom too. Because, I mean, being at a stressful job like that, you know, you need a stable home with like a loving support system to kind of even that out you know so watching this just makes me smile i'm happy about that oh my goodness all right now this time really go to bed <laughs> don't pretend this time to the good reverend dr king working on rocket ships mm -hmm. and we have oh maharshala ali's here home by the grace of national guard unit we all saw that look she gave him, huh? Hey, Taraji don't miss, man. <laughs> Can I get a hallelujah in here? Oh, it's a wrap. <laughs> you already know she got her eye on that. A, a, a female engineer? We're Negro, baby. Ain't no such. Freedom is never granted to the oppressed. Mm. Taken. Quoting your slogans at me. <laughs> I'll tell you about interrupt. Try this, baby. You gonna eat them greens, too. <laughs> know that if he was ever home don't put that on her you better settle down levi jackson right here in front of everybody <laughs> relax <laughs> having a couple of extra degrees ain't gonna change mm. yes your brother gets them and so do you i see where his coming from but i uh, hear he's planning on staying in there it's unfortunate jim is a tall glass of water <laughs> tall strong and i bet he's like a day and <laughs> <laughs> Please have some shit. I will not. <laughs> I will not. Mm, I think he's smiling over here. Mm-hmm. You better smile back, baby. Yeah. Well, I'm not smiling back. Oh. Yeah. Girl, you already did. <laughs> he's coming over. Now, why would he be doing that? Now, this is a fucking wing man if I've ever seen one. Wing woman. She told him, hey, man, come over. <laughs> She's not married. She's a widow. Angels on earth is what we like to call. <laughs> Boy, they set the stage and dipped. <laughs> Fixing my three babies some plates. Mm-hmm. What a gentleman. We calculate the mathematics necessary. <laughs> Pretty heady stuff. Mm-hmm. I will have you know, West Virginia University Graduate School. Tell them. On any given day, I analyze air displacement, friction, and velocity. Tell them. Compute over 10,000 cal square root. The analytic geometry. Tell them. Hmm. They let women do some things at NASA, Mr. Jones, because we wear glasses. Mm-hmm. You just lost your chance, my boy. I love this because, um, <clears throat> obviously, like, there's a lot that I'm excited 
about this movie for not just the amazing fact that like these women really put their foot in there and like made a name for themselves in history but like it's so educational because like i did not even know that i did not even know that that like there were this group of women who like without them the space program and nasa wouldn't be what it is you know so like this is empowering as hell through all the like racism like sexism and everything like yeah i, I love this so much God well, these are the astronauts yeah and handsome must be a requirement too so i have the right to see fine in every color <laughs> she said equal rights we have a fairly tight itinerary colonel didn't want to run off without saying hello <laughs> let's go space <laughs> Launch and landing. Oh, you can't get anywhere without the number. I love that. Engineering, and I'm proud as the devil to be working. Uh, I'm gonna stick it inside. Bro, she my favorite, bro. She always put her best foot forward. And I love him for coming there and giving them props. You know, even had the other women looking. I love him for coming there to like salute them and appreciate them. Like that's very important. Thank you, Mary. John. <laughs> I'm a oh, Mary. Now, that's a stand-up dude right there. Mr. Harrison wants you to confirm launch. I cannot work on what I can't see. Tell him. This is more or less a dummy check. Boy, you gonna learn. <laughs> dummy. She can still see it. Oh, do your thing, baby. I know, y'all. One of my favorite things in movies, I don't know since when this became something I really love, is when people intellectually shit on people. Mm -mm -mm. Watching movies like Goodwill Hunting, watching movies like Dead Poet Society watching movies like uh, a beautiful mind there's always those moments where our protagonists like freaking just demolish people with their intellect and it's like it's like one of my guilty pleasures all i'm saying is if she don't do any of that in this movie it's a missed opportunity but from how things are going i i see it coming so i just wanted to share that I'm afraid not, sir. Can't fit into the room. <laughs> I should know. Just keep going. Use the use the big hammer. Yes, sir. <laughs> Do it ASAP. Hammer, you heard the man. Let's go. She better get her promotion. Oh, it is her nemesis in this movie. Apparently, you can do our calculations in a. I guess that's good for NASA. To replace them. Hurry on now. Best if you do it in one trip. So is that going to replace all the ladies? I don't know why I love Taraji so much. <laughs> I'm going to say it every time she's on screen. Maybe just because I know her real life story and how she struggled before she made it. <clears throat> she's always jogging. I can stand this boy here. She did all that. Yeah. She did all that. Took a picture, it lasts longer. Whose work is that? I said, whose work is that? Tell him. Well, it's no secret why the redstone test keeps and push it into space. Numbers don't lie. Mm hmm Well, what's there tells us between the lines. Mm. From launch to orbit, we know. Redstone mass, we know. And the speeds are there in the data. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. I look beyond. Mmm, their conversation from last time. Atlas. Catherine Goble. Mm-hmm. Are you a spy, Catherine? Am I what? Excuse me? No, sir. I'm not Russian. Or a spy. All right, then. We have nothing to lose here. We clear on that? Uh, are we sure about this? Yes, he's sure. You're not a spy. Uh, you know what I think is a good idea? Darker ankle. <laughs> Thank you, Catherine. Thank you, sir. Oh, y'all gonna remember her name. This interrogation's over. <laughs> I like how she said, I'm not Russian. <laughs> mm. 
Darker ink. Just not the bathroom. This IBM's gonna put us all out of work. I know the computers, right? Somewhere down the line, a human being's gonna have to. Work. Oh mercy. It's break time. Commission females for the engineer training program. Thank you. To any qualified applicant. Absolutely. Everyone who works for me to follow them as well. Y'all should be thankful you have jobs at all. Fuck you. What do you mean thankful you have jobs at all? That's some of that bullshit, man. And it's, I mean, obviously here, like, I love this movie for, obviously this is real story, but for adding a character like her, I mean, <clears throat> I mean, y'all should be happy you have a job here. Bitch, please. I'm not saying bitch as a female degrading term. I'm just using the word bitch as like, you know, when someone's being a bitch. Ugh. And it's crazy because like that uh, freaking like sexism that she's so much under. I mean, what do they say about like being oppressed for so long? Sometimes you pick up the traits of your oppressors. So, I mean who knows maybe somewhere in that lady she's like these men are stepping on my heads whose head can i step on these ladies under me you know so there's that intersectionality there she gets me mad man because a lot of this still exists today that's all you gonna say complain about the way things are we're trying to play card <laughs> court fight for what you want but quit talking about it <laughs> i've been complaining about one more peep about work uh-oh. Catherine, come on. What y'all drinking tonight? Child, I needed this. Don't give her any more, Catherine. <laughs> Drink it all. <laughs> Listen, ever been. You're as drunk as you've ever <laughs> Come on. Let's dance, baby. I love that they still have fun, man. They don't teach you how to you go here, girl. Yeah. <laughs> she said twirl, twirl. <laughs> they must have done it. We don't want any trouble in here. Bitch, keep moving, man. You act right. You are right. I'm staying. Yes, ma'am. You gotta let them know. You took that book. Son, I pay tax. <laughs> hey, take something you already paid for. <laughs> and that's on business. <laughs> As it is the wave of the future. <laughs> Everybody smile. Everybody smile. <laughs> Mama, you took that book. <laughs> I was wondering when we're going to see Soldier Boy again. What? What a surprise. Howard must have invited him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Got another chance. Don't mess it up. That boy got his eye on you, baby. I believe I owe you an apology. That was a good way to start. <laughs> I'm afraid I simply misspoke the other day, Mrs. Go. His voice, God. For a long time, imagine I'm just out of practice. Good save. I was hoping you'd allow me to start over. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Have an interest in getting to know you better. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you want tough customer, huh? <laughs> you haven't said you're sorry yet. Right. She's waiting. I'm sorry, Catherine. Underestimating you. Mm, elaborate. Though I don't imagine there's many. <laughs> oh, that was cold. <laughs> that was cold. As they become available. Yeah. The Vostok 1 rocket delivered Russia. That ruined their whole night. First Soviet astronaut. This is a day of un I don't like theorizing too much when I'm watching movies because like I don't just I just like it to come to me but somewhere in the deepest darkest part of my mind I am hoping no one in NASA sabotages themselves just so they wouldn't have to give credit to these black women because you know sometimes some people can't put the bigger picture in front of them because of that freaking bias and bigotry you know what i'm saying so that would be heartbreaking if that happens honestly but obviously not surprising but let's see i know it's late probably anxious to just go home mm. is it possible that it actually means more to them we're not on some epic joy ride mm. there's only two things you need to know going for working late that's going to be a fact of life uh oh and two don't expect your catch up and pass those bastards 
Hello? For those of you who can't work for everyone else, tell them how it's gonna be. Let's start with mine. Husbands as well, families. <clears throat> oh, I'm excited. My wife and I are gonna get food truck food. Not that I'm in any rush for this movie to end. It's I've been loving it so far. Okay, are we moving up? Holy shit, that shit blew up. Oh, is this a montage of all the America's attempts? Technology is crazy. And how far humanity has came? God damn. I love their earlier talk. End of the day. Yeah, we're, we're looking good. Mm, that's their IBM. <sighs> Sir, it might be the selector lap. I'm taking a walk. <laughs> we got a job to do. Oh, she's going to the school. College seats are at the back of. Thank you, ma'am. Every time I hear that, it's so gnarly. I like. Colored seats, colored toilets, colored. When are y'all gonna offer her a restroom close by? 24,000 multiplication. Holy Moses, that's lightning fast. Mm hmm. It'll run eventually. And when it does, we have a job. No. Big brain, she's thinking ahead. I got a court date. Computer uses it as its high. So the court date is so she can fight for her right to be able to uh, take the class right at the segregated school. I love this movie and how our three characters are going on their own like separate arcs while together. Her trying to Mary trying to be an engineer. Her trying to uh, not just get the promotion she deserves, but also learning the IBMs and how to program it so that they can stay relevant at NASA. And obviously Taraji's character is like the main antagonist we're following and how she puts her big brain to work for NASA. I love it. It's not just focused on one person. So I love to, a lot to bounce around. Oh, well, that's in the wrong spot. Girl. Watch her fixing what they couldn't do. Shepard's trajectories need to be updated. Where is she? Exactly. Give her a bathroom in there. That's what I was saying earlier. Give her all the facilities so she can be great. Having to do all that just to go to the restroom is wild. She's I'm already wet anyways. In heels too. Where the hell have you been? It's not my imagination. Now, where the hell do you go every day? To use the restroom. For 40 minutes a day? What are you doing there? That's the only one she has available. T minus zero here. I put a lot of faith in you. There's no bathroom for me here. Mm-hmm. The West Campus, which is half a mile away. Mm-hmm. I have to walk to Timbuk, and I can't use one of the handy bikes. Mm-hmm. Pearls. Well, I don't own pearls. Colors enough to afford pearls. Tell him. Like a dog, day and coffee from a pot, none of you wanna- Mmm. Tell them. So, excuse me, I have to go to the restroom a few times a day. I love you. There's only so much you can take. There's only so much you can take. That's gonna stick with him. There's only so much you can take. Day in and day out. I can't yes sir to everything. Like, I got limits. I'm a human being. I'm a person. The fuck? Say it louder. Taraji's acting her ass off. Like, that was a surprise. Come on now. If I have to go to the restroom a few times. Mm-hmm. Give her all the facilities she needs. What you gonna do about it? Ain't you gonna say something to them? 
some changes around here. I like that. There you have it. No more white, plain old toilet. Mm-hmm. Preferably closer to your desk. It's still the same old shit. Everybody going shit anyways. Here at NASA, we all pay the same color. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. And girl, that's because you said something. Sometimes you gotta let motherfuckers know. <laughs> My boy about her lunch. Bye, heads. Dear Lord, thank you for this meal. <laughs> the girls are giggling. <laughs> Name we pray. <laughs> They're like, is this our new daddy? <laughs> Land about 35 miles off the coast, USS Lake Champlain. Set out. Hidden figures. That name is so perfect for this movie. Three, two, one. Designation. Is this gonna be a success or? Lift off and the clock is starting. Let me just throw this out there. Every time I do a space movie or a military movie or any movie that has to do with American history, I get people in the comment section with pitchforks coming at me for not knowing this history or this date or that or this event. I am not American. I did not grow up in America. American news is not world news. I bet a lot of y'all can tell me a lot of historical events around the world. So please, I don't know this information. I'm always open to learn. So please don't come at me, which pitchfork is for not knowing the year something happened or the date or the historical event. American history is not world history, right? Like I didn't grow up in this culture. There's a lot of things that are very relevant that I just don't know. And I believe that's only fair. If you see me asking questions around some of these events, it's because I'm actually open to learn and I'm not going to sit here and pretend like I know something I don't know. So uh, put your pitchforks down. It's all love on this channel. So bring that energy or you're going to get banished. You're going to get blocked. I just felt I should say that, please. Okay, let's get back into it. 5G. <clears throat> get on up there. It wouldn't work on the oh those that has an astronaut in it. So this better work. This is not a test flight. Pitch eighty eight trajectory is good. Oh, let's go. Y'all is okay. Yeah. Let's go. It's our last shot before we strap Glenn to the Atlas. Yes, and I imagine he'd like us to have the math. Mm-hmm. Go have dinner with your kids and. She did that. Well, they all did that, but you know what I mean. Look what you've done. Mm. Hey, TV, hey. I love this collab so much because I love both actors so much. I think it's high time I kissed you, Catherine. Shit, boy. Why is that? Figured you attracted to me, same as out of you. <laughs> Type shit. Well, you'd have told me to get going a long time ago. This is true. Haven't kissed a man in a long time. Her husband. Too. <laughs> oh, they double dipping. <laughs> All of us realize that the bus was on the. The kids don't need to be watching they this. They need to see it. Mm mm. We think we are rendering a great service. Petition to attend. Good morning, Your Honor. Bruh, the way he looked at her. Virginia, still a segregated state. Supreme Court says our law. The South is wild. May I approach your bench, sir? I mean, doesn't the fact that she works for NASA give her some kind of... How's that, Mrs. Jackson? To serve in the armed forces. Mm-hmm. The first to attend university and the first state judge three consecutive governors. Mm, she's glazing him. And now he will forever be remembered the first to touch the star. Mm. And I, sir, but I can't do that without taking them classes at the... Mm-hmm. And I can't change the color of my skin. So I have no choice but to be the first. Mm. Which I can't do without you, sir. Your Honor, which one is gonna matter a hundred years from now? Mm. One is gonna make you the first. Mm. You can't say no to that, man. You can't. Only the night classes. <gasps> ah! 
And just so we're clear, I'm not clapping for the judge. I'm clapping for her for like being this resilience and pushing freaking boundaries. Mm. The way she put that story together, like she peppered him up a little bit, you know, with the research she did on him. And she put the story together with the first astronaut to touch the stars and then inserted her credentials looking in there like she works for NASA. And she wants to be the first to do that, that and also brought up how that will make him the judge relevant. Come on, man. We're halfway through the movie and this is gas. This is gas. Translation, this is very good. I love seeing all their stories progress like slowly and steady. Uh, do you have any idea what you're asking? And is there a problem? Mr. Harris. Yes, you should be talking to him. This isn't about plugging in numbers. It's about inventing them at that, right? Doesn't exist. I can do it, sir. Mm-hmm. But you run it all through Stafford, understood? Yes, sir. Computers don't author reports. You're just salty, man. <laughs> You're just a salty man. Liberty Bell 7. Can I help you there? Roger. Liberty Bell. God damn. Unfortunately, the Liberty Bell 7 capsule. That's a lot of money. Whoever gets there first, civilization, and so. Mm. Delivers the capsule into an elliptical orbit, but is going so fast, it keeps missing the Earth. Mm. Slowing it down by precisely the right amount. <laughs> Pentagon briefings are closed door. Well, we can't keep up. I need those changes as they are. Mm -hmm. Sir. Well, this is a very delicate piece of equipment. Bill, we've got numbers. She did that. What kind of numbers? What's your name again? <laughs> Best remember that. <laughs> I love how, how they're all making their mark. Oh, I, this is all moot. That we're all. If I could attend the briefing. Exactly. Through this, it is not possible. There's, There's no protocol for a man circling the earth either, sir. <laughs> you should be talking to the head in charge, not him. And it's crazy because at this point, they must have recognized her value. But they're still trying to handicap her. It's... You attend these briefings. I have to start over. We don't have the man figured out yet. Mm hmm. I feel like I'm the best person to present my. <laughs> she is a woman. There is no protocol. Shut your ass up. You just have to act like one. <laughs> You just got to act like one, sir. You keep quiet. Thank you. <laughs> Morning. This will be interesting. I hate this. 20 miles square is what we can service for. With all due respect, our capsules being all. Mm. At mm. the time the rocket delivers the capsule into Los. Off the dome. When exactly is that going to happen? On the biggest stage. I believe he's given her a chance to prove herself because he don't have an answer. So might as well put his bet on her. 70 feet, 46.50. Keep cooking. Distance, sun. Keep cooking. 32 feet. <laughs> Keep cooking, girl. Okay, so that puts your landing zone at 77.33. He is fuming. <laughs> Give or take. 20 square miles and check this out during the next meeting if they don't see her in there everybody gonna be scratching their head like where's uh where's Catherine yeah isn't it crazy that there are people that their brains actually work like this in real life I mean this is real life but you know what I mean it's it's freaking phenomenal I love this so much I need more manpower I need programmers you're the IBM man right yes sir Mm-hmm. Let's get ahead of this thing. I'm not paying you. What about woman power? We need the IBM for Glenn's launch. Mm-hmm. What about the girls here? Well, they'll stay put for now. What about after now? Mm-hmm. Glenn's launch, NASA's dissolving the... Wow. I'm not accepting unless I bring my ladies with me. Ooh, that was a big stand. A lot of manpower to program that beast. My gals are ready. They can do the work. Mm-hmm. That is such a big stand she took. We've been reassigned. 
Leave your calculators. You won't need them where we're going. Mm, that's such a big stand, especially with her conversation in the beginning of the movie where she said, um, where she said like she see everyone else progressing, but not necessarily her. And saying, she also said something about like, one of us up is like still progress for all of us. Like I'm paraphrasing. So the fact that she turned that down and like, you know, put it on the line for the ladies that like the ladies got to go with me if I'm going like massive respect, massive respect. Yeah, I mess with that. Look at them pulling up like the Avengers or the Straw Hats. Yeah, things about to look different around here. Oh, they're getting paid. Things about to look different here, man. You know what your job is, Paul? Find the genius among those geniuses. Mm. Because he's definitely get it, letting his personal bias. I don't know what time I'm coming home. Either not. That's bullshit, man. Hit the top like this. New pencil. You're gonna make a fine engineer. Mmm, I love that. And nobody of Mary Jackson's dream. Mmm. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Don't make me late. Hey, let her go to class now. <laughs> I love that. All right, gentlemen. I feel like a recurring theme in all three women's lives have been the support they have with each other, the support they have from their families, uh, the support they have for their lo loved ones. Because even back, I mean, till still this day, but back then, I mean, you're not even sure of your safety leaving the house as a black person and as a black women, woman. You know what I'm saying? So all the things you have to deal with outside the house. Yeah. Having that support at home is prime. It's clutch. So I love that. And obviously, shout out to the women and the men and people who even do it without the support. Still go that extra mind, but it definitely helps a lot. And I love that this uh, film, like, spend a lot of time on that and like emphasize that a lot because it is very important tonight we discuss plank einstein yes keep your head up baby i'm mary jackson i'm in a row yes she is well i imagine it's the same as teaching a man should i just take any seat see you right in front baby maybe it's not new math at all it could be old math what does that mean She had to go back to the literature. I mean, I know this is math, but hit the books. That's it. That gotta be like watching magic. <laughs> Let's type it up. Okay. That was the first supportive thing you've said to her all movie. I knew it. Yes, seems to. What you gonna say? I hear the IBM's up to full capacity. My father taught me a thing or two about mechanics. Mm. I may bring them by if it's all the same to you. That would be the supervisor. Yes, that's true. Mm-hmm. I know you probably believe. <laughs> that was wild. I know you probably believe that. <laughs> Nothing against y'all. Hi. Hey. No, you didn't, Mama. Madame. Oh, that's so sweet. Wait, is it my birthday? No. Mama, what's going on? Good evening, Catherine. Mmm. Hey, it's not my place. You either? What's going on here? This whole night. Oh, my tears. That's for me. Are you sad, Mama? It's okay, Mama. Oh, my days. He hasn't even asked you yet. <laughs> You are, right? Y'all let me. <laughs> let him cook. This is my mother's ring. Oh, God. <laughs> she said, hush. She and my father were married for her. For 50. Figure's about as lucky as a ring as you can get. Mm. I said, Mom, 
She says she must be something, Jimmy, really something. <laughs> I plan on this being more romantic. I'll make that up to you. But I know marrying you mm. includes marrying your girls as well. Mm. Amen to that. Mm. I didn't ask you yet. Hurry up. <laughs> <laughs> she said, get on with it. <laughs> oh. oh, man. It's the little thing, is the daughters even finishing the story for him. And like, which shows that he's probably told it to them as well. And like, oh man, this is, you deserve it, girl. Holy shit, they deserve it. Are progressing on schedule. You wanted to see me, sir? Yeah. Have a seat. Oh. Is there something wrong, Mr. Harris? No, there's nothing. How can there be? Long story short, we no longer need a progress as a double-edged sword. You'd be crazy for getting rid of her. It's out of my hands, if you can believe that. You can put, um, stay. You can put in a word for her. That feels like a slap in the face, I bet. Y'all wouldn't come this close without her. Catherine, we heard you got engaged. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's thoughtful of you. Mm, pearl necklace. Dear, really? Although I suspect as we can't imagine he has an eye for anything but numbers. <laughs> no, you have a great one. Take good work around here, Catherine. Mm. Respect. I mean, so many unsung heroes in history. So many. Oh, it's wedding day. I don't think I felt a thing the first time I did. Just as beautiful as you were back then. Mm. Just a little older. Fuller. <laughs> but you look. Well, they're going to keep it real. Yeah. Here we go. They're so supportive, man. So the winged messenger of the gods in Roman the two months, then three days afterwards. Wow. Time skip. First American to orbit the Earth. Thousands of people here today to witness history. Paul, something's off here. He's landing. Something's off. Well, then the IBM's wrong yesterday. The damn thing's wrong today. Hello? Look, I'm going to be honest with you, Al. And right now, it seems like this machine's flying me. For real. Let's get the girl to check the number. The girl. Call Catherine. You mean Catherine? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. I mean, she says they're good. I'm ready to go. Wow. All right, we'll get into it. Roger. He's always been a real one. He's always been a real one. She needs to verify Glenn's go, no go. Shouldn't have got rid of her in the first place. That's all I'm saying. I think it's ironic that now he's the one doing the running instead of her always doing the running, going back and forth. All the final tests and checks out. But today we remain truly... While the calculations are not complete? The capsule is ready. Y'all are brave. He hesitant on his behalf, but let us John Glenn is paramount to the mission. Mm-hmm. So we're still a go. Yes, sir. And obviously they have to, I'm guessing, keep up appearances, right? Like make sure everything looks good from the outside while like they're literally panicking inside, like waiting for the last, like every last thing to be given a go. But on the outside, it's still all dandy. That's it. What the devil are you doing? Are you taking a break? <laughs> Say yeah. Yeah. Half a mile away is wild. Makes us major. My boy is worried. Yes, we can. But like he said, as long as she says it's okay. <laughs> let her in there. Another slap in the face. What the hell is wrong with y'all? Bad 14. Catherine. <laughs> Clarence, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Sir, we've got Pad 14 on the box. She never been in here before. We have the coordinates confirmed. Stand by, Link. She got her pearl necklace on. The landing coordinates match. It's a little hard to trust something you can't look in the eyes. Mm-hmm. 
Catherine did manage to calculate a few. Well, I will take every digit you got. Mm-hmm. Good luck, Friendship 7. Godspeed, Link. Godspeed, baby. It is now aboard the Friendship 7, a height of over 93 feet. Terrifying. And we are go for launch. T-minus 10 seconds and counting. It's almost party time. Look at that thing go. XQ. Roger that, Capcom. 20 seconds to Seco. <laughs> Seco. Go for Seco. Oof. She and I feel fine. Oh, that view is tremendous. <laughs> I bet. Roger that, Friendship 7. You are go for orbit. Thank you, Capcom. Looks like a light bulb. If we make seven round trips. Well, as we approach the end of the day, that's good. Three quarters of the way across the African continent. Hmm. New assignment came down the pike. It's hard to keep up. Superior. Thank you for the information, Mrs. Mitchell. You're quite welcome, Mrs. Vaughn. Hmm. You earned it. <laughs> mm hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Her acting is like just the facial expressions, the little hmm, like says a thousand words. We have a warning light. Oh boy. What are we looking at, Paul? The uh, oh, we need to get him down now. Burn up on re-entry. Hello? Burn on re-entry. There is a man in space, and we don't want to miss it. Friendship 7, danger of losing. Of course, he couldn't go great. That is a negative, Capcom. It's supposed to Tell them not to jettison the retro package. Okay, engineer. Will that work? It will work. This means that you will have to override this. Is there a reason for this? Stand by, 7. I don't know what they're talking about, but seems intense. Roger that command. And bring the scope in. Over. Ay, ay, ay. He knows. Of course he knows. He's a smart man. Without a heat shield, there is no way That's of cutting cool. the Friendship 7's re-entry point, and he must begin the retro sequence. That sounds horrible. The weather recovery area. Capcom, you're going out. Oh my god, communication going out? Oh, he's coming in hot. It's a real Jesus Christ. This man is on fire. Mm -mm. I don't even know if he's going to make it or not. I mean, based on actual history. Friendship 7, do you copy? Over. My stomach is sinking because, like, I don't know if you guys have seen, um... Apollo uh Apollo 13 Tom Hanks shit boy mm. my stomach was oof Friendship 7 do you copy over please respond man They're just going to watch this man go off in flames Friendship 7 do you copy over Ain't no way right they just build intention, right? Because in three, two, please. How are we looking, Capcom? Landing coordinates are spot on, seven. Please. I have always wanted to swim in the Bahamas. <laughs> I like that. John Glenn has splashed down, and John Glenn has. Cause we all know if that ship, if those calculations were. We're off. They were going to be on her head. They were going to be on her head for show. Oof. Being recovered by the USS Noah. Mm. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Nice work. Offer her a job already, my guy. <laughs> you think we can get to the moon? We're already there, sir. Mm, what a beautiful callback. Yeah. What a beautiful callback. He's always chewing gum. We're already there. I like that. Three out of seven is not bad at all. Mm. 
Hey. First African American female. Mrs. Vaughn, your supervisor. Come on now. Sharing the wealth. The IBM data processing system. Sharing the wealth. 24,000 Look at her go. And Katherine Johnson. I put her name on there. Oh, I thank you for that coffee, my good man. I'm talking permanent office, you feel me? Apollo 2 mission. Wow, she got her honors. She got her flowers. Medal of Freedom. Space Task Group. Are they going to show a real picture of her? Mm, Catherine G. Johnson. Wow, Dorothy. Mary. Immortalized. Hidden figures. Oof. That, that goosebumps. Goosebumps. It's gonna be. Mm, hidden figures. Victory. Oh, let them laugh about it. Mm. Yes, it's an uphill battle. The next time y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Mary. <laughs> no matter how deep. Mm. Wow, wow, wow. This film was phenomenal. Like, first of all, I didn't expect the movie to be this hilarious. It had such good humor in it. It had, obviously, you know, you know, just a good fight against like bigotry, racism, oppression, like sexism, everything um, that, like, you know, us and our people have been through and three of them make the perfect squad honestly they make the perfect group um the pacing of the movie was excellent um the movie was very satisfying it was very empowering as well the movie had everything it had its serious moments it had the like raw emotions as well i love um her meeting Mahershala ali's character and you know tearing him freaking tearing him a new asshole after their first interaction and them like meeting up again i love how the people around them um came around to uh give them the respect and the props they deserve later but only as a result of our main character's actions mary going to school going to courts to fight for her rights to attend the class uh dorothy always speaking up about her wanting the uh, position she deserved and also using her intellect as well to like darn near infiltrate the ibm to learn it and make sure she knows how to program it and all that and of course, um, Catherine, always speaking truth to power and using her hard work to get her into rooms where, you know, people won't allow people that look like her in. And it, it was just an all around wonderful movie. I believe I shared all my thoughts about it during the movie as I paused, but this is such a feel-good movie halfway through the movie i went away to get dinner with my wife and i was telling her i was watching this movie and she was so excited because she was telling me how good the movie was but i told her not to say too much because i'm halfway through the movie but this was good thank you for watching please feel free to check out my channel for some other awesome movie reactions that i've done hit that like button do everything you can or everything that is in your means to support the boy i appreciate you take care peace out